Time efficiency is the key that unlocks the door to productivity and success in any job, especially video editing. But for whatever reason in our industry, quick turnarounds and unrealistic deadlines have become the norm. And as depressing as that can be, I'm happy to announce that I've just released a animated preset pack for captions with motion blur that will hopefully help you reclaim some of your lost time. So let's jump into Premiere Pro and let me show you what I'm talking about. So if we head over to our effects tab and open up our presets folder, you'll see we have a Boulevard pack folder titled Motion Blur Caption Animation Presets with 20 pre-made animations for your captions with Motion Blur. And if you wanna download them, go to justinsaran.gumroad.com or the link in my description. And you'll see this here. You just gotta click, I want this. And you'll notice I added two tutorials that come along with the Premiere preset file that you can download by clicking download here. And those tutorials are gonna show you how to install and use the preset. But basically you just have to right click import presets, select the preset file and hit open. And now it'll live in your preset bin inside Premiere Pro right here. Now, the next thing we're gonna do is go up to our text tab. If you can't see that, go up to window and just make sure that it is selected like so. And now we're going to create captions from our transcript. Now in the newest version of Premiere Pro, transcribing is automatic when you import a clip. So we don't have to worry about that. Next, with our caption settings, we're gonna set maximum length in characters to 20 and minimum duration in seconds to two seconds. And then we're gonna set our lines to single and hit transcribe and create captions. And now that is going to work its magic like so. It doesn't usually take too long and we're gonna get some captions. Now you can just go through this tab and clean them up by kind of bringing some of them together that are a little shorter. Hit that button that's going to combine the two. And then we'll go through and make sure there's no more typing errors like so. Once we're happy, we're going to select all of our caption layers from our caption section of our timeline. And then we're gonna go up to our essentials graphics tab, hit edit, and this is where we're gonna pick our font style, color, all that good stuff. Now, these presets work best if they are aligned to the center, and I'll show you why in a second. But with all those captions selected, we're gonna go up to upgrade caption to graphic under our graphics and titles tab, and that will turn all of our captions into editable graphic layers, and we can select all of those. And now it's time for our preset. So we're gonna search for captions, and we'll get this Boulevard Pack folder with motion blur, and we'll pick which one we like, drag it onto all of our clips at once, and voila, we get a nice preset animation with motion blur. Now, one more thing to be aware of is that if you try and change the properties, specifically position, it's going to affect where our anchor point is. So the animation is going to get warped a little bit, but a quick fix is to nest the section you wanna move and then simply move it like so. So our animation is still taking place from the center. And with that being said, make sure to like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.